Good morning, guys. This morning, Kevin was helping me finish the last couple shots of food with Daddy, and it's still very early in the morning, and I'm eating lentil salad for the shot, and you know how just like something really oniony and salty right when you wake up is not always the best tasting thing? I mean, it tastes fine. It's just the last thing I wanted to eat was lentil salad right now. It is delicious though, by the way. Um, I'll probably have it for lunch, but just not a good breakfast item. Uh, so I had to eat it anyway. Uh, let's see, what's going on today? Oh, I have, the top half of me is dressed up for food with Dottie, the bottom half of me is still in my sweats, and it is a cold morning today. Kevin has class at one? One. One o'clock, and then you get out an hour later? 2.15. Then we have the rest of the day, right? Right. We're gonna film our Q&A video for you guys. You submitted tons of questions. Um, obviously, I'm not gonna be able to get to all of them because I cut them off at a certain point after like I copied pictures of all the questions that we were going to answer. Um, but we'll definitely do more, so if your question doesn't get answered, don't worry about it. We'll do it next time. Uh, but I have a lot of work to do before Kevin gets out of class, so I'm going to keep going. What do you guys think? And he's off to his second day of school. You guys vote right now. They're not gonna be able to tell you in time. Beanie or no beanie, quick. I wish this was a live feed. <laughs> Have fun, Kev. Alright. I hope this day treats you well. Thank you, and, and also with you. Thank you. <laughs> so, I have some cool news. My video that I'm putting up this week is a recording that I just spent the last like hour doing. Uh, it's a recording of the final episode of Upside Down and Backwards that I never was able to shoot because I went to Australia earlier than I thought I was going to go. And I wasn't with my roommates anymore so we couldn't film it. So for fun, I did like a voice recording. So it's like a little audio book of uh, the last episode of Upside Down and Backwards because I had written it and we were ready to go but we never ended up filming it. So it's pretty ridiculous. Uh, the content is ridiculous, but also just the fact that I'm doing everyone's voice is ridiculous. So, um, you guys can look forward to that. Here's a little preview for you guys. Upside Down and Backwards, Episode 6, the final episode. Interior, apartment, afternoon. Dot wakes up in a panic. The words, who are you, are cruelly written across her forehead in permanent marker. And she's still wearing her Halloween costume from the night before. All right, we are headed to REI so that I can look at some boots. My goal is to find some that are waterproof, super comfortable, and practical. So I figured outdoorsy kind of store would be a good idea. Check out these babies. <laughs> They're actually really comfortable. Okay, weird thing. I'm an eight, I'm a size eight. They just measured my feet, told me I'm a size seven and a half. These shoes are size nine, so I'm all confused. Uh, but I like how high they are. They're an interesting color. They didn't have any black ones. It's really like light on my feet. Like bouncy. Way more comfortable than my fashionable shoes. Kevin just reprimanded me for wearing two different kinds of socks while trying on shoes. <laughs> that can mess up your uh, interpretation of how they fit. I never wear the same color socks. Um, why are the guys' boots everywhere like infinitely cooler than the girls' boots? I don't understand. Maybe I should start designing some boots. <laughs> Something Kevin and I like to do a lot is just go around for little drives, especially like when he's been in class and I've been in the house all day. It's just nice to go around and look around outside. You can't really see from here probably, but I can see a cool view of the city. Maybe I'll zoom in. That's what mountains can do for you. It can give you an awesome look down into a city. Eleven forty, and as soon as I got back here, I was working up until now. Um, but good news, I have quite an interesting video for you guys tomorrow. You're today, so it's up today. So you guys should go check it out. Um, I'll put a link right here. It is 
a dramatic reading of the final episode of Upside Down and Backwards. It is the weirdest thing I've ever uploaded to YouTube. So if you're curious about what the strange parts of my brain sound like, there you go. Also, I didn't, I don't think I put a link yet to the food with Dottie I did with lentil salad. I'll put a link to that in the description if you guys want to check it out. And tomorrow I have one more video to shoot and then I'll be done for the week. And I've been staying up too late and getting up too early. So I need to find a way to get to bed earlier. Uh, my body and mind are both very tired. So tomorrow, hopefully, I can get outside and breathe some fresh air. I don't know, tomorrow might be another work day. We can see, let's see how much I get done. You guys can motivate me. Tweet me some motivating quotes so I can get my work done before like two, hopefully. Uh, Kevin's doing something really weird, I don't understand. Why are you doing that? <laughs> I think we're all going crazy here. <laughs> I need to go to bed. Um, I don't even know if this is a dream right now. Hope you guys have a great night and I will see you tomorrow. Hey, how does it make you feel?